do you need to trim or cut any part of the video which you need to show to the class? Sometimes the first part, the last part, or the middle part of the video, these parts you don't need at, at all. So in this video, I will be showing you how to edit the video using Edpuzzle. First thing that you need to have before you edit any video using Edpuzzle is first to have the, Ed, the Edpuzzle extension. You may go to the Chrome Web Store and download the Edpuzzle extension. It will be represented by this small jigsaw puzzle looking icon. And once you've successfully downloaded it, it will appear like this in your um, extension list. And when you go to YouTube, this button, Edit with Edpuzzle, this button should appear beside the title. Okay. So, for example, I'd like to edit this video, Vertebrate and Invertebrate Animals. I'll click the Edit with Edpuzzle button. And another tab will open, will be directed to your Edpuzzle account. Okay. First, um, oh, well, before you edit, make sure that you have already signed up. Make sure you have already created an account in Edpuzzle. All right, so we see here that the video is now opened in the Edpuzzle um, tab. If I click play here, the video will play. Now, to cut, to cut or to trim your video, you simply move these uh, endpoints of the video. The blue area shows the entire length of the video. So if I move this one, if I scroll this one to maybe this one, let me just close. The, that ad. If I scroll this one here, then you will see that the video is changing. The video is scrolling towards that point of the video. Okay, this part will now be trimmed. And if I move the other end point of the scroll bar, then the entire thing, the entire thing after this end will now be trimmed. It will now be. We could also actually add questions within the video. I'll just click on the question tabs here. And well, for our puzzle, we have three different kinds of questions. Actually, there's two multiple choice questions, open ended question, and anywhere in the video, you could actually uh, add a note um, to give more uh, notes or comments to your viewers, your students. For example, I'll add a multiple choice question at this part. I'll type here my question. What are vertebrates? Okay. Choice here, animals with fur, animals with scales. Add another choice, animals with which lay eggs and I like the last choice to be my correct answer animals with backbones and the correct answer should be marked with an e with a check while the while the wrong answers will be marked with an X and then click save Aside from multiple choice questions, let's try adding an open-ended question. Let's scroll the video somewhere here. All right. At this point, let's add an open-ended question. So let's add our question maybe, uh, what is present in birds which are, which is not present in any other vertebrate? And of course, you know that the answer is feathers. Only birds have feathers. Click save. 